Hey guys, I'm Mike and welcome to this session of Rescue Academy. So in this session, we're going to talk about how to be a world-class shamer. After doing this for a lot of years and honestly fighting my own battle with shame, I've learned something about it. It takes time to work through these issues. Psychologist Carl Jung once said, be patient with the crippleness of the world. And that's a good word for all of us. Healing is a process and you just can't rush it. All right, so let's talk about the difference between shame and guilt. People often use the words guilt and shame like they are the same thing, but really they're very different. And I wanna point out some of these clear differences right now. So guilt says, I did something bad. It's the discomfort we feel for violating our own values. Where shame says, I am bad. And that's an intense belief that somehow we are inherently flawed and unworthy of love. Guilt says you can do better. It challenges us to grow into what God calls us to be. While shame says you are broken, it defeats us before we even begin. Guilt says I confess. It admits its wrongs and moves on. While shame says I'm fine. It hides behind a wall of false confidence and compensation. Guilt says you'll be forgiven. Shame says you'll be rejected. Guilt can be dealt with through wise counsel, but shame must be healed through love. So this topic is really key to helping people be free and find hope for life. And when I started looking around, I discovered, honestly, some pretty lame ways we try to deal with our shame and try to help people in their shame. Many people have tried these strategies to overcome shame, either in their own life or when helping others. But sadly, they don't work, though many of us still believe that they do. So I'm gonna give you four of these ways that don't really work, and then I wanna offer up a powerful strategy that does work with healing shame. But first, here are the four strategies that we try that won't really work. Strategy number one, the give yourself a trophy strategy.